Hi, and welcome to another Earthworks Two Minute Turf Talk. Uh, I'm Kevin Hicks, and I recently had an opportunity to spend a couple of days with our friend Nathan Cox, the owner of Desert Green Turf. Um, he's been he's continued to be an innovator in the sports turf market, and uh, he once we got back to the farm, we were able to look at a, a test plot that he's doing for FIFA. Um, they've got their big event coming up in 2025. And one of the products that they're testing is what he's calling a hybrid grass. It's manufactured by a company named Target. It's called Playmaster. And it's basically a hybrid between artificial turf and natural grass. Um, you'll see in the, uh, the video here that uh, uh, it starts with a, with a synthetic material, very open weave synthetic material. And they use a, a series of brushing and top dressing to infill uh, that artificial surface um, with a root zone mix and then seed into that. Uh, pretty interesting way to look at things. And um, we, uh, we looked at the process. I also got some video uh, footage and, and some photos of, of how they get that, that uh, surface established. Once it's established, then it'll be harvested. They come in six foot wide rolls, but it's harvested uh, in kind of a standard uh, configuration of four foot big rolls. Uh, it'll be harvested with a special, um, I guess you could call it a sod cutter, and uh, that removes the backer, uh, the synthetic, and the natural grass all in one, and then they'll transplant it onto, uh, in this case, it'll be Lumen Field where the Seahawks play. Um, generally, I'm not a big fan of artificial turf. This is kind of an interesting take on it. Um, still doesn't solve some of the dis disposal issues that we've all talked about, but it definitely uh, addresses the player safety concerns that we've seen from, from a, a true artificial surface. Um, and I think in certain, certain instances, it could, it could uh, uh, solve some of the wear issues as well. So it, it was interesting enough for me, even though this is a natural grass-centric uh, podcast, it was interesting enough for me to uh, to try to bring it to all of you, and hopefully you find some value in it. Um, kind of kind of a little unusual take for us, but uh, uh, still uh, still something that's interesting and going on in our field. So I figured it was pertinent. Hope you enjoy it. Hope you enjoy the photos. And uh, as always, thanks for listening. Thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe. 